Hello everyone, my name is Denise. Um, this morning I'd like to talk to you about um, what the Lord has been saying to me. But first of all, I would like to speak of the different ways that the Lord speak to me. And the reason I'm doing this is because many times I would, you know, see prophets or prophetic people coming with a prophecy from the Lord. And I myself would wonder, how did they hear from the Lord? Was it through dreams, visions, or was it audibly? How did they hear from the Lord? And so this is the reason I will be explaining the different ways that I hear from the Lord, just to help anyone who is interested in how the prophetic works. Okay, first of all, I hear from the Lord in an audibly way, just as if, just as how I'm speaking and you can hear me now. I hear from the Lord audibly. I hear through dreams and visions. Also, it's sometimes I'll receive like a download of information if I was there when the event took place. Okay, those are some of the ways that I hear from the Lord. Right, Um, on the 3rd of March, 2020 this year, um, the Lord has been speaking to me and he spoke to me in an audible way and he said, tell him that the dead in Christ shall rise. And I said, Lord, who is he? And the Lord said, the people, the remnant. And I said, Lord, who is the remnant? And he said, scrutinize it meaning look at it, look into it, examine it. Who, who do you think is the remnant? You know, and so this is um, the reason I wanted to come and give this word from the Lord, what he has spoken. He said, the dead in Christ shall rise again. This to me is a word of comfort, of consoling his people. Because so many events as I've spoken on my previous video, so many events are unfolding in this world, these last days that we're living in. And it will be worrying for some, but the Lord is consoling his people to let us know that, you know, the dead in Christ will rise again. Even if we should die today, no matter what may happen to us, if we live a righteous life before Christ, we've accepted him only and, and live a life that is pleasing and acceptable to him. He's assuring his people, the remnant, as he said, that they will, they will rise, they will reign again with him. So we don't have to fear death. All these things that are happening in the world, no matter what it is, we need to be at peace. We need to rest assured that it is well with our soul, according to the word of the Lord. You know, as I said before, we are living in the last days. We, we are living in end time. And I just want to encourage, you know, anyone who watched this video to say, you know, we're living in end time and, you know, accept Christ as their, as their Lord and Savior to repent of their sins, be baptized and accept Christ as their Savior before it's too late to sure, uh, be assured of where we will end up eternity after eternity. You know, so these are my few words of encouragement, especially to those as well who have not accepted Christ and to those as well, as the Lord have stated that, you know, it is well. Thank you for listening. Take care. Bless you. Bye-bye.